Well, currently we are in New London. This is the downtown area and very specifically the New London City Pier. Now that the sun, well, the light has come up this morning. We can thankfully now see and show you a little better about what we're working with. Now, as far as specifically the water, the ocean out here, it is very, very choppy. It's not as windy as it was even an hour ago. Whenever I saw you guys, that wind and rain had really picked up with a strong band that was moving through New London and through this area. Now it's kind of tapered off to a drizzle and we are actually standing behind a building right now, which is why it is not quite as windy as it is in some other places. I will say we are under a coastal flooding advisory and a wind advisory here along the shoreline. This is not just for New London. This is for all of the Connecticut coastline. I will say, even though we do have some periods of heavier wind and rain, it's not been anything that's necessarily going to stop you from being able to do anything this morning. It is going to be something that may slow you down a little bit, but it's not going to stop you. I'd say give yourself a few extra minutes to get where you need to go, whether that be work, school, whatever it may be. But this is what you're facing if you do live here on the coast of Connecticut. Just some extra high winds, a little bit more rain here and there, but it is again in, not something that you guys can't deal with. Obviously something that we see all the time, maybe just a little elevated at times. So keep that in mind. Maybe not a day to take the boat out. That one is up to you, but I probably wouldn't recommend it this morning. Live in New London, Brooke Griffin, Fox 61 News.